Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover complementary and supplementary angles. I'm going to talk about what those words mean, and then we're also going to take a look at how to find missing complementary angles and missing supplementary angles. We have two complementary examples and two supplementary examples. So let's jump right in to number one. For number one, we have complementary angles. Complementary angles are angles that add up to equal exactly 90 degrees. So for number one, we're given a 70 degree angle. We need to figure out what this x equals to equal 90 degrees. So 70 plus what equals 90 degrees? And some of these are harder than others, so some you may be able to figure out using mental math, some you may not. So what we can do, we take the 90 degrees that we want to get to and subtract what we're given. We're given that 70 degrees. That's, that's our known. Subtract these and that difference is what x is going to equal. So 90 degrees minus 70 degrees equals 20 degrees. So x equals 20 degrees. And let's double check. 70 degrees, what we were given, plus that 20 degrees gives us 90 degrees. Again, complementary angles add, add up to equal exactly 90 degrees. Number two, these are complementary angles as well. We have a known here. We're given 48 degrees, so we need to find what y equals. So we can take our 90 degrees that we want to get to, subtract what we're given, and that difference will be what y equals. So 90 minus 48 degrees gives us 42 degrees. So y equals 42 degrees. 42 plus this 48 equals 90 degrees. So 48 degree angle and a 42 degree angle are complementary. Number three and number four, we're going to move to supplementary angles. Supplementary angles have to equal 180 degrees. So for number three, we have a 65 degree angle. We need to find what angle A equals in order to get to 180 degrees. So we use the same strategy. We can use our 180, subtract our given or known, 65 degrees. 180 minus 65 equals 115 degrees. So A equals 115 degrees. So let's double check that 115 degrees plus the known of 65 degrees equals exactly 180 degrees, so that 115 and 65 degree angle are supplementary. So let's move on to number four, where we are given 128 degrees, and we need to find what angle Z equals. These are supplementary angles, so we know they have to equal 180 degrees. Let's subtract what we're given, 128 degrees, and that gives us 52 degrees. So Z equals 52 degrees. And 52 plus 128 degrees equals exactly 180, so they are supplementary. Now, one thing I do want to mention before we end here, this is how I remember which is which as far as complementary and supplementary. The C here is a lower letter in the alphabet, so it aligns with the lower number. S is further along in the alphabet than C, so it aligns with the higher number. So there you have it. There's complementary and supplementary angles. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.